In this video of crystal structure, we will learn about simple cubic unit cell. In the video so far, we have shown atoms connected by the rod to visualize crystal. But in reality, crystals are made up of only of atoms or molecules. There is no spacing between them. Rather, they form as much compressible structure as possible by mutualizing themselves. This rod actually represents the bond between the two atoms. In a simple cubic, eight atoms form this structure by joining with each other. To understand fundamental translational vector, let's take an example of one-dimensional lattice with a lattice parameter A. Means the distance between two consecutive lattice points is A. So, from origin, translational vector of lattice point A is A i cap. Translational vector of lattice point B is 2A i cap and translational vector of lattice point C is 3A i cap. In the same way, in general, the translational vector of this lattice will be NA i cap, where N is the integer and A i cap is called fundamental translational vector. Similarly, fundamental translational vector of two-dimensional lattice will be A i cap and A j cap. And if lattice is three-dimensional having lattice parameter A, then its fundamental translational vector will be A i cap, A j cap and A k cap. Lattice parameter. The lattice parameter of any lattice is the distance between the center points of its two consecutive atoms. Here, we assume that the lattice parameter of simple cubic is A. If the atom of simple cubic having radius R, the lattice parameter A will be equal to 2R. Volume of the unit cell. If the lattice parameter of simple cubic unit cell is A, then the volume of this cubic cell will be equal to A cube. In terms of R, A is equal to 2R, hence the volume of simple cubic unit cell is 8R cube. Number of atoms per unit cell. What is the total portion of the atom inside a simple cubic unit cell? In the simple cubic unit cell, all 8 atoms are situated at the 8 corner point. If we consider any corner atom, then we find that only 1 by 8th part of the atom is inside the lattice and remaining 7 by 8th part is outside. Hence, only 1 by 8th part of each corner atom of the lattice will count within the lattice. Since there are 8 atoms on the 8 corners and 1 by 8th part of each is inside the lattice, the total number of atoms in per unit cell will be 1. Volume of atom in unit cell. The total volume of atom in unit cell is the multiple of the number of atoms in unit cell and the volume of atom. Since there is only one atom in a simple cubic unit cell, an atom is spherical, therefore the, its volume will be 4 by 3 pi r cube. Hence, volume of the atom in simple cubic unit cell is 4 by 3 pi r cube. Packing fraction. The packing fraction of any crystal indicates how much part of the crystal is filled with the atoms. The higher the packing fraction, the denser is the crystal. Also, the crystal will be more strong. Packing fraction is the ratio of the volume of atom in unit cell and volume of the unit cell. In the simple cubic unit cell, total volume of the atoms is 4 by 3 pi r cube and volume of the unit cell in term of r is 8 r cube. Hence, packing fraction is 52%. Means, 52% part of simple cubic is filled and remaining 48% part is vacant, which is called void. Volume of the primitive cell. Primitive cells are those cells having total number of atoms is 1 inside the lattice and all atoms are at the corner points. Simple cubic unit cell is a primitive cell having fundamental translational vector A i cap, A j cap and A k cap. Hence, its total volume will be A cube, which is same as the volume of the unit cell. Therefore, in this video, we learned about simple cubic unit cell in detail. In the next video, we will learn about the body centered cubic. I hope you like this video. Subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to never miss any update of Physica.